name's Kevin Smeltzer. I'm from Fergus, Ontario. I've got this 1986 Ford uh, LTL 9000. It's got a 400 Cummins in it, big cam, 13 speed, new way air ride. I bought it last year at an online auction from Brian's Farm Supply. So I've only owned it for about a year, but the truck was originally from Napanee, Ontario with Millen Transport. And then it changed hands a few times and a guy named Mike Coverdale did pretty much all the restoration on it. It's got a 95 cab, but the interior and everything from an 86 is still in there. Everything on it works and that, but uh, it just gets used as a toy basically now to haul my toy hauler around. So it's just, yeah, just something fun to have to basically go get ice cream with. So. <laughs> And do you drive? Are you a trucker? I do. I haul livestock for Lockhart Transport. I drive a uh, 2018 Freightliner Coronado glider for my regular job, just company driver. So this is just my weekend hobby truck. What got you into an old Ford? I've always liked the look of the Fords. And then I was looking for either a cab over or something different that you just don't see. And Peterbilt's and Kenworths are just hard to get your hands on. So this come up and i seen it at an auction and a couple of refreshments later i just kept clicking bid again and next thing you know after the weekend was over i owned it so yeah here we are with it basically but i love it it's a fun fun truck to drive it's you know just it catches eyes everywhere it goes because there's just not a lot of them around especially in ontario that are you know not rotted out from the salt and everything like that so yeah. Is this the first show you've taken it to? Uh, I had it here last year and then I had it to a couple other local shows. Uh, once I get to know it more, I'd like to go to some farther away. But until I get, you know, just comfortable with the mechanics of it and stuff like that, you know, it's got, it's an 86 Cummins. It's got a couple oil leaks, this and that. But until I know it's sound enough to drive a few hundred miles, then yeah, I would have no problem taking it anywhere else. So, so I just do a few local shows for now and, and enjoy it that way.